I thought it would be a good idea to put some of the most popular keychain flashlights through a series of torture tests. So I froze them into a solid block of ice, submerged them in super hot water, drenched them in lighter fluid and lit them all on fire, dropped them from 2 meters and finally drove over them in a 4Runner. The Rovivon A5 is worse for wear and the plastic melted from the fire but somehow it's still completely operational. The E1 had some issues with the hot water submersion but after a few days it dried off and it completely works. The TIP SE from Nightcore also had some water trouble but it too bounced back after drying out for a few days. The Tiny 2 made it through all of the tests until the drive over where the screen cracked but it still works. And unfortunately the Tiki also did not survive the final drive over test, but the Olight i1R2 Pro, the Lumen Top Frog, the Phoenix E03R all basically look like they're brand new, which is really surprising because 